Hmm. <laughs> You gonna say something in there? She's just in her phone. She doesn't care. No? You think she ever cares? No, she doesn't care. As long as she's in the phone, right? No, as long as she's playing my game and as long as she's in the phone too. Yeah? Yeah, that's all she care about. And her friend Stephanie. Oh, he just said you only care about Stephanie. Oh. <laughs> She mad, yo. <laughs> you mad? Yeah, you Look mad. at her face. You mad or no? Leave me alone. Uh oh. Y'all gonna start a fight at Walmart? Huh? We only got two people. Yo, it's like three days before Christmas. It's packed in here, but it's always packed in here. Christmas! How do you feel about Christmas coming? Christmas! Matt, what, what are you waiting for? My gifts. Yeah. What you think you got? Everything I got wanted on my list and more. What more did you want? I don't know. But y'all know what I like because I get it in Walmart. Y'all be like, no, you can't get that. Because you want to buy the whole Walmart if you let you. <laughs> so yeah, I might get more and know what it was. Mm -hmm. What did you want for Christmas? Uh, I wanted a gas RC car, roller skates, a skateboard. Yeah. What else you wanted, son? Uh, I wanted a skateboard and... Uh, Look, turn this way. They can't see you. Go ahead. Uh, uh, I also wanted a Hot Wheels track, but um, I was going to make one out of scratch, so I was like, oh, never mind. Uh-huh. And what else? And something else. I don't remember what it was. That's it. Uh, and Dad, what you wanted for Christmas? What? What you wanted for Christmas? Of course she's going to want some MC Square dolls. Or I don't, don't want to get dolls anymore. That. She's way over there. I don't care. <laughs> I was gonna get me. I wanted some skates, some new games for my. Wait, Nintendo. don't move up yet. You want to skate? New game? Move back, my friend. You're in the aisle. See, they got the lines on the aisle. That means we gotta wait until they call us or there's space from up there. We don't got no space yet. Okay, so let me so tell you something. Wait a minute. You, what you want? I forgot what else I wanted. Okay, what do you want for Christmas? What did you want? What did you ask for? I asked for roller skates, games for my, games for my Switch. Mm-hmm. And what else? <laughs> you don't remember? No. Oh, okay. okay, so <laughs> on the Christmas, we went to like our family member's house or our friend's house, and this girl chose a switch over an MC square dog. No, she chose the she MC chose the square, MC square dog Look, over you had a switch. Told every had told the switch. I had told Mimi that I was going to get her to McDonald's. So. She doesn't really say it like that though. Yeah, she doesn't say it like that. She says McDonald's. So we're on our way to McDonald's. We're like two blocks away from McDonald's. Mm. And I'm going to get her the typical Mimi stuff. She has the chicken nuggets. Yeah, the Happy Meal. Yeah. The chicken nuggets and french fries Happy Meal. With some apple juice. She's the juicy queen, just like her dad. Oh, Lord like Jesus. You see this line, Adira? Oh, no, that's the waiting. Yeah, so. Don't mind me, I'm just Hi, talking. can I get a six-piece chicken nugget Happy Meal with apple juice and apple slices? Okay. That'll be all. Question, please. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't mind me. I'm just scarfing a whole sandwich because I haven't eaten breakfast today. No, because she wanted to be up at like 10 o'clock. I mean, um, she wanted to be up until like 1 o'clock at night and decided wow. to get up later. So yesterday, we had a package that was supposed to be delivered. 
And it was a package for Amina's favorite teacher, Miss Brown. And the package literally got taken off of our floor, off, off of our porch. steps, right? And it Sorry, did get time. delivered, but Amazon, the whoever delivered it, they didn't knock on the door or um, press the bell or anything of that. Hold on. Oh, it's taking me too long to grab it. I thought okay. it was more. Okay. We're over. No problem. Alright, left there and we have a big sign posted up saying make sure you ring the bell three times, not hard, we're all the way in the back. And on top of that, there was a sign on the door, on the gate door that says, we you're on camera, you. smile. Right. So, Amazon didn't do none of that. Just a happy meal, right? Yep, just a happy meal for my three-year-old, <laughs> four-year-old. Thank you. Have a great day. You're welcome. So, anyway. So, yeah, so Amazon didn't do any of that. So, the package got set, set there for an hour and a half. Some guy came who robbed us before. He came, took the package, went around the block, opened the package to see what was inside, and then left the block, the box on the block that was around the corner. Um, I called the precinct, the 103 precinct, and when I called them, um, because this wasn't the first time, I started asking the detective what's going to happen. So the detective blatantly says, Oh, well, we can't really do nothing even if you have a recording of the the perpetrator because we don't know his name, we don't know his age, we don't know where he lives. Even if you saw him on the on the block and you could point him out, you still you still can't ID him. Right? So they said and even if we did catch the perpetrator, right? He got the nerve to tell me that even if we did catch the perpetrator, the perpetrator, nothing's going to really happen to him because it's petty larceny, number one. So the judge is just going to have him locked up for maybe 24 hours, let him go with a ticket. Right? Post who the person was the first time, and I'm going to post the second time that he did it. So basically, even if we, like, we're trying to abide by the rules and everything, and even though we're trying to abide by the rules, like nothing's really happening. So we're we're dying to get out of this area. It's not really a good area. Uh, when we get back to our I'm house, I'm, uh, well, we have a couple places that we're gonna move to, but we don't know for sure where we're gonna move to. And I'm still angry about. They told me they tell me this like two days, at, like two weeks after they they really put the thing in stone and I don't want to move like I'm gonna miss my friends she's like oh you're gonna be fine we're obviously gonna come back and see them that's not the point okay yeah because she think oh my god anyways let's go back to what I was saying so um we are gonna move just not right now um we do not like this area it was good while it lasted but it's time to move but um yeah so when i get back to our neighborhood i definitely will show you the evidence of the robbed item because